Correct. I'm going to explain a little bit how I build my Gundams. And the tools I use are a nail clipper. This one has a cool little slant to it. A file, hand file. It's better if you have the grip. This one in particular has a flat side. On the other side is curved. It has to it gives you more um, precision, I should say. Because if there's a curved part, you can just use the curved side, of course. And the flat side I use mostly. And just a little bowl of water. And how I clip is I look where the uh, tree is sticking out from the bottom. If it's sticking out from here, then I would cut there. Cut there. Like this guy, for example. Uh, I'll go ahead and cut him out. And this is cool because I can use the tip of it. I usually when I cut, I try to cut as close as possible. If not, I can always trim it after it falls off. And now you see like these little parts that are sticking out right there. You can get that with the nail clipper. And it does a pretty good job. Or close enough. I'll just get as close as you can. And what we do is we get our little tub of water. Stick our little hand file in there. Spin around a bit. And just attack it. You gotta use just light pressure, do not use heavy pressure. You will destroy this piece. Usually, uh, after you're done, you don't even notice that you'd, you'd maybe scrape too much off. Oh, and the only reason why I wet sand is because after you're filing, all you gotta do is stick it in the bowl and all the the dust comes off. So it's pretty much nothing to clean up. Before I used to sweep. I do it dry and I was just sweep. It was a mess. I get it all over my hands. This is actually the cleanest method that I can think of. Well, anyways, um, there's that, and I was going to say one last tip is that I usually look for like one part. Let's say if you're building uh, the wings, I build the wings. I clip off all the wings and I'll sand it, and then I'll build the wings by itself. I don't build cut one piece sand, cut one piece sand. No, I just zoom one body part at a time, and um. When you're taking these off, uh, I I don't twist anything off. I try not to twist because when you twist, it creates a like a, a blue, uh, not blue, a uh, a white little strange mark, and that looks pretty ugly. The only things I twist off are these little nubs or the the joints. Mm. I think that's pretty much it.